We're here at one of the most amazing places on the entire planet, and that is Masjid Al-Aqsa. And this is without a doubt one of those places that is beloved to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. We're talking about the entire complex of Masjid Al-Aqsa is a blessed place. The entire complex is Masjid Al-Aqsa. Sayyidina Sulaiman alayhi salam made three du'as here at this very place. That, oh Allah, if anybody comes to this land and prays two raka'as, that their sins be forgiven like the day they were born from the womb of their mother. My brother and sister, 900,000 people are living in Khalil and around the villages of Khalil. There is so much history here and there is so much to visit and connect to here. There's the resting places of many of the greatest prophets that we often read about in the Quran. The maqams are the resting place of Sayyidina Ibrahim and his blessed wife Sayyidatuna Sara Sayyidina Ishaq his wife Sayyidatuna Rifqa and the list goes on. There are also many other interesting things that people can do here. There's the visitation of the city of Jericho, which is considered the oldest city in the world. And it's thousands of feet below sea level. And there's an amazing experience of going up in a cable car to that mountain. It's very rare to find people who've actually been to Palestine. People go on Umrah, they go on Hajj and rightly so. But this is one of those places along with Masjid Al-Haram and Masjid Al-Nabawi that is mentioned specifically by the Prophet ﷺ that we should come to and we should even take an arduous journey to visit. The Prophet ﷺ repeats three times. He says, go to it and pray there. Go to it and pray there. Go to it and pray there direct command of the Prophet So we'd really like to invite you to come along on another amazing experience with Ziyarat Tours. I would urge everybody to make time to come here. Most of the tours are about five days and within those five days you can explore the majority of the key features of Masjid Al-Aqsa and the surrounding area. So inshallah we pray that you will be able to join us in our next visit. Ameen wa sallallahu ala Sayyidina Muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.